So it is day 22 of my 30 days of service and today was an extra special day of service because my partner Greg joined me for today's mission. Um, so it was really nice to have him and I appreciate him taking time out of his busy schedule to join me. And we both went and paid a little respect or some gratitude to our troops. Here's what we did. We were with an organization um, called Operation Gratitude which was founded some quite a few years ago now by a woman by the name of Carolyn who was fantastic. And at its core, it's all about assembling and sending care packages to our active duty troops all around the world. So a wonderful concept, I think. And, you know, it gives our troops a chance to open a package from people they don't even know and hopefully feel a little bit of our gratitude for what they're doing to protect and serve all of us and hopefully gives them a little sense of home. And so in these boxes is so much stuff. They get uh, DVDs and CDs and Girl Scout cookies and um, t-shirts, deodorant, razors, shaving cream, beanie babies, so much stuff in these fairly sizable, not huge, um, but good sized boxes. And um, it's 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 a great concept and so when you go to work on the assembly it's at an armory out in Van Nuys and you basically work on one of two huge assembly lines and there were hundreds of people there today and you either so my job I was assigned a task of um, putting t-shirts into a box into the boxes or then at one point I was doing shaving cream which I thought was funny because I don't use a whole lot of shaving cream so I feel like I helped give away the supply of shaving cream that I personally don't ever use and then I was helping to keep just the supply of everything running and things like that and Greg was doing the same he was keeping lots of the um, folks who were actually putting the stuff in the boxes he was their backup and making sure that they always had product to put in which is really tiring work and it was in you know probably around 80 degrees out in the valley today and um, we're in this armory and it was hot and but it was great so one thing that was really cool is that there were people of all ages there were um, early teenagers there all the way up through seniors and taking on different types of jobs and it was really nice to see. And there were people, um, active duty military there, filling care packages for um, other active duty folks, as well as civilians like myself. So it was really a cross section of the entire community working together to give a little gratitude to our troops, which was really nice to see. I love seeing young people out there. Um, and I loved seeing seniors out there and you know there were vets there and military family members and just a really really great representation of the community and everyone out there as I said working towards a common goal of giving back to those people men and women who truly put their lives at risk every single day so that we all have the freedoms that we are blessed to have. So um, they could not be a more deserving group. I come from a family that is has quite a few military folks in it and um, they all deserve all the gratitude that is possible. So um, a huge thank you to all active duty as well as veterans, um, as well as the military families who keep everything running here on the home front. So a huge thanks. Um, it was great. We did uh, over 9,000 care packages were assembled today, which is more than they expected us to all get done. So it was great. So thrilled to be there again with them. Um, I will go back again. I've taken my mom there in the past. Now Greg has gone. And so I'll take some more folks um, at a later date. So it was great. On to day 23.